Okay, this is Ronnie Gallagher back at the ball field with Brian Hightower, the East Rowan baseball coach. Hey, Brian, you know, you just got through playing in the state championship. Why don't you tell the kids what, what that's like, just being in the state championship? Well, being in the state championship was a heck of an experience, a heck of a ride for, uh, for myself and the kids and, and really the whole East Rowan community. Uh, just, just coming along, winning a bunch of ball games and, and playing for something that, that not only means something to the kids but to the community. It was a, it was a great experience for both of us. Now, you know, one day some of these kids in Morgan Elementary might be playing for you at East Joanne. What do you think they have to do now as little kids to get ready for high school? Well, I think the biggest thing that you got to address is uh, you got to make sure that you're taking care of your academic work. And uh, when you go out and, and you practice baseball, you practice 110% and you, and you work hard at everything you're doing and you listen to your coaches. and uh, They'll teach you how to play the game right and how to act right on and off the field. And then, and then do your work in the classroom is the main thing because you can't come to East Rowan and play baseball unless you're doing your classwork. Hey, can you remember what it was like when you were an elementary school kid playing ball? I loved it. I mean, you know, you, we, we got out there and we played, you know, baseball, you know, organized baseball, but then we were also out there in the, in the yard and out there in the street playing, you know, some form of baseball, whether it was cup baseball or whatever with the stick and any kind of wiffle ball. So, I mean, you know, right. baseball's great. And, you know, you can also tell them that the size really doesn't matter. I think we both know that, right? Well, that's one sport, you know, where size doesn't come into play. I mean, in baseball, you can be short, small. Right. Big, tall, anything you got, and then mm -hmm. you can go out there and play the game. Whereas, you know, basketball, you mm -hmm. want to be taller, and mm -hmm. football, you want to be a little bit bigger. But mm -hmm. baseball is a sport where you can be any size and play. Sure. Well, you know, Irwin won the championship the other night in the middle school, and it seems like the talent just keeps coming through. Easy throw in. Well, what's it like being an East Rowan Mustang? Well, right now the town's real good. I mean, you know, we're going to lose five seniors this year, and uh, it's going to be tough to replace those guys, not only because the great players, but also they were always leaders and, and they always did their classwork. I mean, they always made a lot of A's and B's and, and so it's going to be hard to uh, replace those guys, but you know, every year you got to do that. Uh, we've had to replace kids in the past, and but there's a great you know, great talent coming up through, and it was good to see that uh, we won that game. Irwin won that game one to nothing the other night, nine innings over China Grove. So it seems like we got some good players coming up, also. Now you know this is the third year in a row that you've been the the county coach of the year, so it's got to be all coaching, right? <laughs> I'm the first to say it's never about coaching. Uh, you know, when when you got kids out there that play like ours do mm. and play as hard as they do, it's mm. it, it's nice to uh, mm. go out there and just. Uh, you know, give them a little bit of instruction, a little bit of motivation, and uh, watch them go play. Brian Hightower, ladies and gentlemen, a winner. All right, Ronnie Gallagher back here on, on camera. We're sitting here with Micah Jarrett, Trey Holmes, and the coach, Brian Hightower. And this isn't the first time they've been on, on film. But tell us about your uh, TV experience. Uh, we had WBTV come out, uh, I guess, a couple weeks ago, probably about the second or third round of the playoffs, and uh, come out there and just... Uh, filmed a little bit of practice session and uh, interviewed our, our three seniors and uh, you know it, it was a fun experience. It's a little bit different doing that. Yeah. Well, Trey, what's it like that being a uh, East Rowan Mustang? To tell the Morgan kids. East Rowan is awesome. Putting on that Mustang jersey means everything. I'm gonna miss putting it on. Yeah, yeah. Now, you know, what elementary school did you go to? Rockwell. Or Rockwell. It, and I guess there, there wasn't a rivalry between Morgan and Rockwell there. You got to wait till you get up into school, I guess. No, we played Little League yeah. uh, football, Pee Wee football yeah. together. Yeah. Those two schools were combined. Uh, tell me what it was like when uh, when y'all went to the state championship. What's it like just being in that environment? To tell, tell these kids. Take it over. Well, I mean, I mean, it's everything you think it'd be. That's what you play high school baseball for. I mean, that's what you play Little League for, you know, to prepare for that next level. And, you know, took it as far as we could take it this year. And, um, I mean, it's just a great experience. Now, both of you are going to play in college. What's it like playing for this guy back here, Hightower? He's Marcus getting Hightower. ready. Uh, yeah. He knows what it takes to get there, and he's prepared us as good as he can. Yeah. Has, do y'all ever play any games? Is he as fast as y'all? Is he as good as y'all? He ain't as fast as Brian Hatley. We know that. <laughs> <laughs> that is for sure. Yeah, now, that you you, you sure. got to know, kids, that uh, Hightower had to race his assistant coach. And uh, you want to take that one, Brian? Well, you know, I figured I had him because he, he, he outweighs me by about 100 pounds. But uh, he's got me 10 years younger, and I found out that I'm not as fast as I used to be. <laughs> Don't judge a book by its cover. <laughs> That's right. But um, what do you think the future is for East Joanne guys? I mean, Irwin won the championship the other night, and it's got talent coming up through there. It's bright. Um, as long as we got a hot tower over here, you know, coach and everything, everything should be good. And what do you tell the kids at, at that age? You remember when you was played at, at that age, what do you tell them about one day maybe becoming an all-county baseball player. Don't quit trying. Yeah. Park as hard as you can. Don't give up. <laughs>